What about data that exists at other levels inside your organization already? Most control systems can't get SCADA to work together easily with MES and ERP because they're outdated and they don't work with modern IT technologies that are found you know, at the enterprise level in organizations. The gap there between SCADA, MES, and ERP keeps many companies from connecting up their whole enterprise. Unfortunately, this gap between systems leads to unnecessary waste, missed opportunities, bad decision making, and as, as we said, SQL databases are already in use by most MES and ERP systems. So when you're using SQL with SCADA, you can connect these uh, three levels of software together easily. And, and I realize sometimes if SCADA, if sometimes you hear that people, if it ain't broke, don't fix it philosophy enters in. The SCADA system's working, but it's working to do what SCADA systems do. It's not bringing together that entire enterprise. MES essentially is that middle layer between SCADA, which is at the operational level, and ERP, which is at the enterprise or executive level. So MES software actually is designed to bridge the communication gap between the plant floor and those executive levels. MES software does that by tracking and improving things like downtime, quality, SPC, recipe management, track and trace scheduling, genealogy questions, and a whole lot of other functions. So there's a lot of valuable data at that level if you can just, you know, get at it. Connecting SCADA to MES without the help of SQL databases happens to be a real challenge. It requires multiple applications, multiple operating systems, lots of time getting data to and from the plant floor and back to the executive level. But if you've got SCADA software that utilizes SQL databases, getting SCADA and MES to communicate turns into a fairly simple process because both systems are speaking the same language. So English, Ignition allows you to then connect and collect the information easily at the MES level. You can add third-party MES modules to your Ignition platform or easily integrate Ignition with an existing MES system and you can connect to the ERP system of your choice. In a company uh, survey, our integrators told us that one of the most common requests that they get is to connect the data from SCADA systems to ERP systems. ERP handles many aspects of business management, such as some of these here, your supply chains, procurement, human resource, financial, sales, and, you know, just a, a whole lot more. And also, we have to deal with the subject connecting to web services. Ignition can connect to web services, whether it's a simple object access protocol, SOAP web service, or a representational state transfer, REST web service. One of the common web services applications is to allow Ignition to communicate with ERP systems. For example, Ignition could pull production orders from an ERP or update the ERP at the end of a production run, either direction. It can uh, also access things like work orders or schedules or production definitions and asset information. So it's, it really empowers the enterprise when you've got the plant floor and the top floor connected. And the ERP connection to web services is critical. Kyle, just, I, I just was mentioning a couple things from the top level. Are there other types of data from web services that you might want to connect SCADA to? Uh, yeah, absolutely. Uh, we, we routinely pull uh, weather data for a lot of our SCADA systems. It allows us to react to uh, possible dangerous weather, uh, such as tornadoes, uh, hurricanes, uh, stuff like that. Um, you know, we also get minus 40 degree weather up here, so we need to be prepared for that type of stuff. Um, and then internally in our, in our own uh, timesheet system, you know, we built our own timesheet. Uh, project management, uh, expense tracking system inside of Ignition. So uh, some of the things that we do is we pull uh, hour by hour currency data from web service and we also use a, a web service to mail out our invoices. So companies that won't take email, uh, we can just invoke uh, a REST endpoint, uh, send them a PDF with the address and they'll go out and uh, mail that letter for us. So uh, just, a, just a few examples of the web services that we've connected to uh, on our own. Great, thanks. I totally appreciate that. I mean, if you think about it, um, we really have, you're talking about more and more data coming into the enterprise. Um, we've talked about various sources you can pull data from and bring into Ignition. Uh, you can gather data from multiple sources onto one platform. Then you can use a set of powerful development tools and to, to do things with it. Um, so Ignition has rapid application development tools. It has web launch designer application that provides concurrent design clients and a uniform design experience. 